Alright, what's up guys, and of course always, welcome back to an old game, which are truly Skyrender. And today we're up against Nelly, who is just such a great person, somebody that's been <laughs> around for so long for the Generation 7, and it's just been a blast fighting her. She is monstrous, and yeah, she is monstrous. <laughs> I've never beaten her so far, and yeah, like... That that that's a Dragonite and it's a Latios and it's a Magnusone and Dangrove and you know it's it's all about whoops I'm dying painfully. <laughs> but it's all good though. Like I am all about the Ursa Ring. Damn, that's a cool monster brain to this meta. And uh, I really wish that jump love would have been great this game. It probably won't, and I still forget to take a picture of the team. Uh, let's see. Oh it's a Swampabert! <laughs> that's that's not ideal. <laughs> we're actually we're gonna throw the niche here. We're gonna make the thumbnail work. Let's let's go for that solar beam. You asked for it, you're gonna get it. I'm sorry, but at least I get something right once. What is the saying called? At least a clock is twelve or is it right once a day. I can't speak. There we go. Die, Swampert. Piece of shit. You are no more. <laughs> <laughs> no rocks! Hell, I'm down! <laughs> oh. So, so, so that was, um... <laughs> ah, I, I can't speak. That's, that's, that's never gonna happen again. Um, right, here comes Lodios and wins the game. Um... Actually, Wiglitov is not half bad here. And... With no rocks, Kotal should keep his 30s. That's gonna be magnificent. Um, <laughs> let's see. I barely remember what Lodius does. Besides ruining my day, let's see. Psychic. It's still gonna do a lot, right? That's, that's a still massive hit. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's up there. So, do I Dazzling Gleam here or predict and go for Fire Blast or go for Safe Ice Beam? I like Ice Beam. I like rocks too. I, I like to go for Stealth Rocks here. Predicting the Magnus Zone. At least I get rocks up, that's gonna be helpful. Tangrove. Ah, that's worse. That's worse. Rocks gonna be helpful, but yeah, yeah. What do it even do? Sleep powder, right? Fridge or sleep powder or sludge bombs annoying as all hell. Um He's not super fast, which is kinda great. Wish it was a vital spirit at this point this point. Gonna send in Grecta, I mean, you can't quake, I guess. I'm, I'm predicting Sludge Bomb. I'm, I'm feeling Sludge Bomb. I'm feeling Sleep Powder too, really. Um, knock off. Ha! Weakest move that ever got into me. Now, die. <laughs> so, I'm feeling Ladios comes in here, right? Power knockoff. <laughs> I'm on fire. Like, at, at this point, if I can just wrap up the game here, I would be fine. Like, yeah, I've, I've done my place. <laughs> Let's see, I hope Fire Blast still does a lot, though. Yeah, it's resisted, sure, but please. Kind of half expecting Defog. Ah, Magic Boo is still switching. Not a strong one, but it is a switching. And I can get some competitive boost. Yes! That's why we use Wigglytuff. That's why we use it. It is a fantastic mon. <laughs> he is very competitive. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> so. I'm gonna go for Fire Blast. I, I gotta predict the Magnuson. I'm. We're gonna lose the Ladios to Wigglytuff. The ultimate just disrespect. <laughs> Get it. It's Magnuson, Magnuson, Magnuson. No, it's Tangrove. Not what I wanted. Connect the Fire Blast at least. No, Wigglytuff, fucking damn it. We needed that to fucking work. <laughs> That's not right. Um, I gotta do that again. Right? Come on, Magic Boo. That's a killer hit for sure. Close. That was close. That was really close. I am very fine with that. 
Ooh, that did a lot. Tangrove is not a switching. <laughs> if only. She just had gone from Gaston Vein, really, didn't I? Um, guess we do that now. Get to predictions game. Use Regenerator or Sack Tangrove. Two very tough decision. I'm down with both. Competitive wheel that might just be the worst thing she ever got to experience ever. <laughs> I am so fine with this. Alright. Probably not the biggest focus on Stealth Rocks right now, but the competitive boost, I am. Mm. Mm -mm. Things got tough. <laughs> Alright. Like I said, I barely remember the team anymore, but Dragonite is a thing. Ursaring is very much a thing. And it is absolutely faster than me. Right? That's not what I'm dealing with very well. Kinda half expecting Protect and the Toxic Orb to kick in and makes my day just the best. You know, it's an Ingrector. I mean, it is useless here anyway. Hmm. <sighs> I'm feeling guts more than anything else. Let's see, protect, yeah, so yeah, it is. Plus the part is it's not super speedy at all, right? That's that's super poisoned. Um She would quake on this. No facade is just fine. There is no way she's quaking. I am loose in this, come on. <laughs> yeah, facade, like there is. What was the other play? I can't remember. <laughs> um, I mean, nothing outspeed this guy. Come on, Kotal. Gotta realize that Custop Berry might have been overall smarter. Hammer on. Choice bad at hammer on for you, that is. Either you get me keep my sturdy or you try to attack me. Goes for earthquake, it's not gonna bring me down, right? No, not even close. And this earth this hammer on will do what? Fucking kill ya. <laughs> That's right! Mm. <laughs> Love Golem! <laughs> kotal, kotal, kotal. Whew. So it is, you know, in theory, a sack game I probably can't win. But at this point, I don't care. <laughs> um, okay, this is probably a bit annoying. Just a little bit. Um, I'm gonna try to break. Yeah, earthquake, fine. <laughs> like I was thinking. I was going to try to just break whatever it can do to me, because at this point, I am not in a good spot. Um, so Earthquake is kind of annoying. I mean, Majin Buu is kind of fine. Nice Beam here definitely can do something. Granted that I'm not in range of a surprise Iron Head and stuff like that. Let's see, is it Bandit Earthquake? It is a Bandit Earthquake. Fuck. Ah. That's not annoying. So, I can't beat Magnuson. I cannot beat it. Right, Syndesap. At this point, I just go for a Soul Stance, I think. And. Trying to do everything in my power to hurt Magnuson. Which won't be a lot, because I'm still a jump bluff. So, it's it's an uphill battle from here. Most certainly. <laughs> um, what I can do is Seed Bomb. Should do maybe 25%, something like that. It is Scarfed, that's fantastic. Seabomb will do what? 
Ah, that's almost surprisingly bad. And switch out to feed a Safira and uh, hmm. Like What would my play be here? It should still do a lot on an elite boost, but Um Yeah, I'm not feeling as solid as I did before. I needed Wigglytuff to kinda of work this out, though. Psychic here. I need this guy chipped a little bit somehow, possibly. Switch this out, damn shame, really. Two Lodios. All right. Should I risk it? Let's go for Draco, hope and Windows P tie or possible scarf. Switches out, okay. Goes into back to Magnestone. And I miss it. Of course I miss. <laughs> so now he's gonna lock him or she's gonna lock himself into uh, flash cannon instead, or maybe Volt Switch. Flash Cannon should do what? Definitely better damage. Like I said, I just need a chip. And a special defense decrease would be real nice. It's a weird situation. Like, I just want to beat this scenario, right? Yeah, not ideal, not ideal at all. Um, fuck. I mean, E speed just takes me out, right? As it is, right? That's that. That's that. That's just how it ends. Yeah, I have to sack Cinder Sap here. Um, because of E speed. And then. Soul Stance, I think. Ah! Oh, it's gonna come down clutch anyway. Like, this is not a scenario I wanted to be at, and I just don't know how to stop it. <laughs> because I think it needs two Soul Stances, and that's gonna be a tough sell. At least one. Wonder. No, she switches out. Probably go into uh, Dragonite. No, goes into Lodios. I think that works. Not sure, but I still like need to go for a. Uh, for a bullet punch, and I probably need to do that against. Because it has served, like, it's going to hurt. I need to break the Marvel scale and only do that through Stealth Rocks. And I assume we're gonna see something like a Fire Punch. But then my opponent will be locked into that Fire Punch. Goes into Dragonite. I'm nervous. Possibly for all the wrong reasons, depending on the sets. Yeah, go for as much damage as possible here. Um, and I will do slightly under half, and we go in to get Fire Punch. It's gonna be the strongest one I ever got into me. And all I can hope for right now is I don't see leftovers. <laughs> so far, no leftovers. I only hope it's Choice Bandit, and I can roost this off. It's gonna come clutch. Don't be, be locked. Be locked into that. Switches out, alright. Or it could be Scarfed. I'm leveling here all the possibilities. It just, it has to be banded. And the flash cannon is going to be ruining me anyway. Oh. How much did flash cannon do last time? 
don't even think it's a roll, that's the thing. I'm not even going to like over predict here. I think the ESP is going to wrap it up and that's going to be it. It's going to be down to wire, which is exactly what I want. And I want, I, forgot, I got myself a Wigglytuff game and that showcase alone is all fine by me, really. So, we are now at roughly 90%. I can only hope if it's banded that ESP doesn't take me out and if it's scarfed, then she got me anyway. Come on. E-speed will do. Oh, damn it! That's a crit! Fuck! <laughs> GG, Nelly. GG. Uh, let's see. What was the roll? If it is adamant... Max... 80... Ah. It was a 20% chance of me losing. Fine. The crit mattered to an extent. But in the end, I got like what I wanted. I do not care about that crit one bit. But it's just fun to know that it was definitely, without the crit, it was a roll and it was definitely not in her favor. <laughs> but that said, I, yeah, I am very happy with this game. Well done, Nelly. If you're watching, as always, thank you for doing your soap, enjoy this game. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care of one, right? Bye.